Pussies! Hello! Welcome to your mid-September to the beginning of October read for this current year. How are my favorite little fishy folk doing today? I hope very good. You're so cute to love you with all your little pretty rainbow scales. I, don't know. I always think of, like you're sign like more like the rainbow fish story than anything if that makes sense because I don't know I always liked that book and that was the one thing about fish that I actually remember but you know yeah anyway before I begin everyone I'd like to thank you for all the views subscriptions and requests for personal readings you guys are really making this like way more enjoyable than like what I thought it could be and I adore all of you of course down to business now Pisces this is for Sun Moon rising and Venus check your charts this resonates with you a good deal if not do not worry about it it is just a card game after all right shit won't work if you don't believe in it just boop your nose and away you goes right right also cross watchers switch where necessary Take what's yours and leave a pound of salt with it, okay? Okay. Also, if you're new to this channel, if you want a personal reading, my information is down in the description box below. First reading is on the house, of course, and I do take tips and donations. If I really like you, I might let you get two for free. Ooh. Here's that. <laughs> All right, guys, let's see what is going on with you Pisces. Ten of Swords. Jesus Christ. I wish people would leave you the fuck alone. Like, man. And the Four of Cups down here. You're feeling betrayed and you're still possibly feeling the effects of the betrayal. Or that could be somebody you're dealing with, right? It's like, what the fuck did I do? The thoughts and feelings. You got, like, the Queen of Swords. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Trying to be decisive and stuff, and the root of that with your thoughts and feelings is depth reverse, possibly Scorpio. You might feel like something isn't over or someone hasn't changed. We got the Queen of Pentacles up yonder. Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, of course. Manifest and create and stuff all on your own. Okay. Two seconds, my card has decided to fly. We got a lack of clarity with the Ace of Swords. We got the Emperor down here. That could be Aries. And your vibration is judgment. Will you resurrect? Will you get the right idea about something? Either way, it's going to lead to an end of conflict for you, right? Mmm, Pisces. I swear, you guys, for like a year now, have been having somebody just like up your ass. It is like annoying. It's just like, why won't people leave you alone? I don't understand. Let's see. Like, definitely some torture or, like, some betrayal that went down with the Ten of Swords. It's just got, like, all these cups pouring over somebody. This spirit. Someone needs to be decisive because things are ending on their own, I feel like. Or something isn't over. Like, the Queen of Swords cuts things out. And if you're thinking of cutting something out, it's because something isn't over yet. Right? Ten of Swords right here. We have the Knight of Cups. Could be you. You got your... Charisma, you got your spellbinding capabilities. Then I got the Empress right here, counterpart to the Emperor. And the Seven of Pentacles. Hmm. Like, did someone sweet talk you? While you were just lounging around as, like, the Emperor's being like, Oh, it's just a lazy day. There's no reason to do anything at all. And then, like, they got, they ganked you a little bit. Like, reproductions, there was not. Like, someone might have ganked your coin. And that might have you all sad with the Four of Cups, right? So there's a call for a shapeshift, change, Knight of Wands right here, Leo, Sag, Aries. Here you are with the Queen of Cups. It's like this person just like changed up the game and immediately your intuition kicked in like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold up. There's something up here. And yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. yeah you, like you are feeling shit out and then your intuition kicked in and it let you know that this person like might have 
flip the script on you a little bit. That is that is one of your cards, Pisces. Oof, that's not good. Someone did some thievery on that ass, I see. Yeah, they left you all out of order a little bit. Queen of Swords reverse. You feel like a scorned woman a little bit? Or is this something you're dealing with? Cross watch your switch where you need to, of course. And you figure out the change because there was no communication between you and this person. They ganked you for something. Like the seven of coins here, it's like you're supposed to get something right and into you, but instead it went the other way. Thank you, Larry, for cutting the grass at this beautiful time of day. Yay. Well, it's not even five yet. But it was like they like they got you, and it took you a minute to to figure it out. But you definitely knew it was them, right? So now we got you going Queen of Swords upright over here, where you're definitely gonna be like, "What am I cutting out of this bitch? Who's getting the knife?" You know. You are in no way being shy and timid about cutting this stuff out either. You're letting this shit be known that you will put an end to this. Ew. And you have Death Reverse down here, which is the root of it. Yeah, you're definitely like cutting this shit out, man. Uh, or to not feel trapped and crucified anymore, right? Now, the root of this is what's not ending or a person not changing, right? Could be a Scorpio. It's like you didn't even want to fight for it. I hope that land. I hope that lawnmower isn't loud because that's louder than my music. But yeah, it's like um, you felt trapped and confined. You don't want to, that's why you're putting an end to it, putting death to it. You're not letting it be quiet either. You're just like, I am done. The thing that didn't change, I almost feel like you just want to give up on it right now. Because um, you know the things you know. You know when you, like, you got, like, the high, like, the queen of cups and the high priestess right there. Like, And just because the person changed their actions, you know. Like, you don't need to know the evidence, you just know. That, uh, this fire sign possibly is, like, they, it, it's almost like they're not as smart as they thought that they were. Like, if they had a web up, it's fallen apart, because it was, like, you know, someone blew some, like, weed smoke on the spider, so it just started making its web all funny and shit. Flies went through it all the time. This person wasn't very smart the way they w did, went through shit, I feel like. Over here with this judgment, right? Somebody wanted to be the overlord supremacy over what options they were dealing with a queen of coin here like someone wanted to control the options with this possible capricorn taurus virgo you could have that in your chart that could actually be representing you since like up here she's the one who creates and manifests stuff right trying to come back in from the cold this motherfucker ain't run his, like, lawnmower all day. But now he's on the job. Well, I can't complain. At least they maintain it, so that's a good thing. As long as they don't hit my, like, tomato buckets. That's the important stuff. Alright, so this Queen of Swords right here. What's going on with her? Yeah, you're done waiting for some results. I feel like someone screwed you over again, you guys, and that's terrible. Someone's always trying to come in and screw you over. Might have been that same dude who did it, like, uh, last year that I called out about, right? Um, this death reverse right here, something that isn't ending is this person's possible mouth, and the devil reverses over here. Could definitely be a Capricorn you're dealing with. It could also be someone who might be a little bit obsessed with you. Uh, comes up being, like, a nice little child and being like, yeah, I like yous, you know, but they're not. It's like they just play a little bit. Oh, hold on a minute. I'll get you a guy. Like. Hmm. His overlord is swooping in for options with a queen of coin. But it's almost like to escape like some bad thing right here. And it's like this Queen of Wands is when immature and just talked a lot of fucking nonsense. I guess thinking you're not gonna do anything, which is like, okay, like that's kinda dumb. Like why would you be talking shit? Like, 
Cage Wands Reverse is always the shit talker. They're just always the one who's got a mouth. And here's the Emperor over here, who they're running their mouth to. Which is like, okay, that's not entirely smart, but whatever. This Queen of Coin, right? You don't know what option she's gonna take. Like, she can manifest whatever, but like, she doesn't know what she's going to because she doesn't know which result is good. Which one might lead to, like, an Ace of Pentacles reverse scenario for her. It's like she doesn't know how to produce... Okay, she's looking at the options with these, uh, two of coins, right? But they're reversed, and then it goes down to the Ace of Coins reverse, and it's just like, you know... I feel like she's worried about what she's going to manifest and what she has to produce, which might be nothing if she doesn't choose anything when it comes to you, Pisces. Or it could be a Cancer or a Scorpio, but it's like they don't know if they want to give you anything because you're, you know... You're not in the best of moods when it comes to them, really. This could also be your counterpart, because the Queen of Cups is down over here. But they might see you as being a bit selfish or whatever, which is, like, kind of weird, considering it seems like they ganked your change, but, you know. Some people just like to make you look like the bad guy just to make them feel better for the guilt that they put you through. Of all the bullshit they put you through. Okay, this lack of clarity with the Ace of Swords was this new beginning with the Ace of Wands. Like, someone was, I feel like, lied to about this new beginning. Now they're coming out of the Five of Swords energy. Being in the Five of... Well, yeah, I said Five of Swords. I didn't mean it, but I meant Five of Coins. But yeah, that's there, too. That's there, too. Cold beans. Anyway. Someone was confused about this new start being, like, a lead out of feeling, like, distressed, confused, concerned, and complexity. Someone like, somebody thought that this, I think this person who ganked you for whatever it was that like you found valuable and just straight up pissed you off, Pisces. Like, I think like they had either had the wrong idea of this shit, like giving them a brand new start or they misled you in order to get your change about a brand new start, right? So the Emperor right here, could be an Aries once again, he's showing up trying to get establish control, but someone over here is just running their mouth about it. And he's just standing there like, okay, whatever. He's secure. He's a bit of a miser with his securities, but he's secure. Isn't trying to come back together with this shit, though? Because it makes him fucking crazy. Queen of Swords once again. So yeah, this is, it could be you trying to find control in the options with this Queen of pentacles but it's like you kind of dodged a bullet i feel like pisces just enough okay up here there's a bad judgment call don't resurrect shit with this bitch like if you're wondering if you should i'm telling you don't might be a capricorn might be a virgo might be a taurus but don't do it. Like, don't resurrect dick with them. Because, like, they're looking at you like you're the only one who... They're looking at you like you only want money. But it's also like... Because you took my money. Um, you know, it's probably why I want it. You know, it, it, it's called return back to owner, if you weren't aware, little miss. You know? But yeah, you're pretty... Like... Yeah, this person... I almost said it was you, but it's not. It's like this person, um... This person wants to be, like, a, somebody's trophy wife or just live the comfortable life. They just went about it the whole wrong way. Like, look at... Oh, Jesus. Okay. That one's such a pretty song, but it's, like, so dramatic. You know? Like, this is in Halo. <laughs> but it's, like, this person wants to be comfortable. They want to be taken care of. And it's, like, they went about everything the wrong way, I feel like. This emperor down here, right? He's, yeah, that's why he's ignoring this, uh, like, little mouth right here, because this person's all pissed off and shit at you, right? Like, he's looking over all this and be like, do I really want to answer this person when they talk through shit? No. Nah, it's all good. You know what? Like, I'm gonna take what I get, 
and I'm going to just leave. I think that's the best course of action for you, Pisces, maybe. But that's really up to you. And cross-watchers, of course. Uh, just tread carefully, you know? Because, like, some people are just, 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 like, you know. Like, we all really are just one day away of losing our shit. Um, the thing is, though, we gotta decide what that is going to be that's gonna make us lose our shit. And sometimes it takes a super lot for you to lose your shit. But the good thing is, once you've lost your shit to that point, it's really hard to get back to that edge again, so there's no worries. All right. Pisces, that's the end of your reading. If you guys enjoyed this, please like, share, and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it, of course. You don't have to if you don't want to, but, you know, it's up to you, really. Alright, I will see you guys next time. Like, I love your faces. Take care, and bye-byes.